Hello everybody and welcome back to the Rock and Reaction Rollers where we react to music that we grew up with from the 60s to the 90s and my name is Tammy. Tonight we're going to start the bands that begin with the letter B. Uh, we finished the A's for the most part and um, down the road you know we if you think of any more I don't know when we get to A's again or how we'll do it down the road but for right now we're giving this a try and um, we're on the letter B's. This way I think we won't miss as many songs and I'm hoping to not miss as many requests. So get your request in. There are a lot of bands that begin with the letter B. I just started jotting a few down the other night just so I would see what we were dealing with and uh, there's quite a few. So um, tonight we're going to do a request uh, for Tammy and actually I think two of these songs are um, requests from Tammy but the first one we're going to do um, we're going to go back to 1973 and we're going to play the band Black Oak, Arkansas and we're going to play Jim Dandy and some people called it Jim Dandy to the rescue but it's been shortened I think over the years so now it's Jim Dandy so we're just going to get right to it. Oh, I'm going to stop this song right here. My sister had this album, and so I remember this song well, and I uh, have always really liked it. It's a great song and a great band, and I always thought a, a, an underrated band, another one of these underrated bands. But I haven't heard this song in years, and um, so thanks for the request, Tammy. It's a good one. Uh, again, we're doing the 1973 hit by Black Oak, Arkansas called Jim Dandy. So we're just going to get right back to the song. Oh, I guess I ought to say my reaction first. My reaction to the lyrics of the song is I just think that anytime there's a, a girl in distress, you just got to call Jim Dandy because he'll be right there to rescue you. That's what I think it's about. <laughs> so let's just get right back to it. Oh my goodness, it's a wonder the tonsils didn't fly right out of that girl's throat. 
I wouldn't have wanted to have to sing that night after night like that. Um, but that lady's name is, uh, let me see here, I know it's last name Star, Ruby Star. And uh, I never knew until tonight there was actually a woman singing that. I thought it was him singing it, the guy that's singing in the song. Um, but let's just read a little bit about what they say the song is about. Actually, this song was written by Lincoln uh, Chase, and the first recording was in 1955. And it was sang by R&B singer Laverne Baker. It reached the top of the R&B charts at number 17 on the pop charts in the U.S. Um, in 1973, though, this band, Black Oak, Arkansas, recorded the song, and um, they were always considered the pioneers of Southern rock and roll, uh, with his raspy voice, his long hair, and his stage annex. That's what made them so great, too. Um, and it says that this song is about a man, Jim Dandy, who rescues women from improbable or impossible predicaments. It proved popular enough that Chase wrote a second song, so this would have been the first guy that actually wrote the song, because his last, that's Lincoln Chase. He wrote a second song for Baker, which is the guy that sang it the first time, entitled, Jim Dandy Got Married. <laughs> I'll have to look that up. I've never heard that one. <laughs> but anyway, to get back to Black Oak, Arkansas, which is the people we're talking about, um, this was their biggest hit, and this hit... Uh, was number 25 on the pop charts and featured Jim Magram, who had already been using Jim Dan Dandy as a stage name before they covered the song, and female vocalist Ruby Starr trading off vocals. Um, so anyway, great band. Um, and something else I noticed that, gosh, kind of tell my age a little bit, I guess, but Midnight Special, I forgot all about that. I guess when it was on, most of the time I was probably too young to be able to stay up that late. And I do remember watching it a few times, but, you know, always had American Bandstand, and then right after it was Soul Train. And I forgot about the Midnight Special at night, but I remember my sister watching it, and I remember bragging, hey, I get to watch it, and you don't, kind of thing, um, for a few years. And, and I'm not sure what years it was on, but I didn't get to see much of it, but I knew it was something I really always wanted to watch, because <laughs> I loved rock and roll, and still do. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the song as much as I did. And thanks again, Tammy, for the request. Um, so we're going to go for now. I'm going to try to get a couple more songs on. And then we're going to go for the evening. And hopefully everything goes through tonight. I uh, missed you guys last night, so I'm back. Um, but be sure to tell those people that you love, that you love them each and every day. Be sure to subscribe. It's easy. It's free. And once you've subscribed, you're in and you don't have to do it again. Um, you're in and then you can comment request uh, just anything you want to do once you've subscribed so come join our little rock and roll family and we're going to go for now so peace out